way I was done. On, honorable Senators, I think this issue is uh, well praised to it, it shouldn't be. Yeah? I want to give Senator Onyonka one minute and we conclude this matter. Mr. S Mr. Speaker, thank you so much. Um, I, I really beg you, sir, that I'm beginning to be very discouraged being in this house because I hardly get an opportunity to speak when I have to. And my seniority should give me precedent. Thank you. Mr. Speaker, under the Powers and Privileges Act, if you sit and look at what that act talks about, you as the Speaker of this House has no business discussing or deliberating the issues which are taking place between Jubilee and the Azimio Coalition. Mr. Speaker, I really, really want to congratulate my brother Mungatana You've been in this house for a very long time. What you have said today has made me have extreme amount of respect for you. Let us not sacrifice this house on the expediency of the political wars that are taking place in this country. Let us protect this house because, Mr. Speaker, this house is protected for me to come and discuss anything, particularly issues of national interest. And I may not be able to speak them out there because somebody may sue me and say that I have actually destroyed their name and made allegations against them which are not true and they're all false. But this house, the privilege and the protection that I have in this house allows me to discuss anybody and anything so long as it's within the law. That is the standing orders and the constitution. Mr. Speaker, I want to beg with you. Be greater than many of us. Be greater than even yourself. Make a ruling that protects the Senate. Allow the two parties to go and fight out there but allow this house to be independent and for the house to do what it is legitimately meant Senator to Nyonga, do. I, I give Thank you, Mr. Speaker. The way forward. I did that. And I want to